Stephen Cook, Cook Saw Manufacturing, and I was just demoing uh, a new super wide sawmill uh, that we built. Wanted uh, wanted everybody to be able to see it. Uh, we will sell this sawmill uh, from outside to outside at 62 inches. On the inside of the throat, uh, this mill will cut about 54 inches all the way across, so it cut a, you know, through a 48 inch. Uh, very easily. This was uh, a little over 36 inches that we were cutting here and uh, our standard type mills wouldn't quite cut it so we're building a larger mill and we're going to offer this with, with uh, different widths uh, something that'll cut through 48 inches and through 50 inches if we want to or, or 60 inches if you need it that wide and going to be offering some different features. This one does have a 35 horsepower fuel injected motor on it which was more than enough horsepower uh, but we'll be making some a little bit narrower so maybe they'll be portable uh, this one would take a little extra special effort because this head being as wide we talked about why people do different size band wheels but it's a little over nine feet wide so we would have to turn this head or, or make it just a stationary meal for somebody if you wanted this one uh, but uh, anyway we wanted to show it introduce this to you and we're going to have about three different models of these. If you have uh, some, some few things that you would like done differently, we're going to have just about three models. But we can make it uh, where it's power fed uh, with, uh, with electric. We can raise the head up and down like our MP32, if you might have seen it, up and down with electric. Uh, those would be a couple of nice features to add. But as it is, it is just a manual push through mill. And it's built for, for big super wide cuts. So if you have an interest, just let us know. We'd be glad to help you out.